Hey guys, this is Chromo67 or 67 Studios coming at you with another custom Lego minifigure review. Today we have Guy Gardner from Papu Monkey on eBay. Link to his store will be in the description below. So yeah, Guy Gardner is the second Green Lantern of Earth um, after Hal Jordan and followed by Jon Stewart. And I will actually be reviewing another Papu Monkey figure of Jon Stewart um, soon after this one. So, yeah, this is a very nice figure. It is digitally printed, I believe, and it has printing on the back and the front of the torso and on the front of the legs. So, yeah, it's a very nice minifigure. Uh, I don't know if you can see it very well, but there is printing on the front of the legs right there. Very nice. Does not continue around, unfortunately. The torso printing is also very nice. It does go around in the back. And the digitally printing, you can feel the printing, like all digitally printed minifigures. So I find it pretty nice. Uh, I don't dislike it. Some people really dislike digitally, digitally printed minifigures, but I'm personally okay with it. Uh, he comes with his Ron hair from the Harry Potter series. I believe that's when this hairpiece first originated from. If I'm wrong, correct me in the comments. And his face has green eyes and matches the character very nicely with a nice little smirk. There is no back face, so that's a little unfortunate, but it's okay. So I got mine for about 16 or $17, I believe, but his prices do change a lot. So I think they're going on for about $20 now. And it is a very nice minifigure, and I definitely recommend you picking him up. So this was a fairly short showcase. I'll give you a quick 360 and then I'll show you him with the other two Green Lanterns of Earth that I have. So here's Guy Gardner alongside Jon Stewart and Hal Jordan, the three Green Lanterns of Earth uh, from, I don't know, I don't really follow all the ones after that with Kyle Rayner and all them, but these are the three that I really know about. And yeah, he looks really good and he definitely fits in with any Lego collection. So, yeah, that's about it for this review. I'm um, sorry for the lack of videos as of late. I've been very busy with school and um, just a lot of other things going on. And, yeah, so hopefully I will be reviewing the Green Lantern Lego set and the Jon Stewart minifigure very soon. And I will see you guys later.